positions. One, two, three, go! Yeah! <laughs> we did it, Rolly! We conquered Mount Bingoli! Time to celebrate! Well, if you say so. Hey there, guys. Mind if I borrow a cushion? <laughs> hey, look what's on TV. That butterfly looks a lot like the ones on TV. Oh, whoa. You're supposed to be on a journey with thousands of butterflies. <gasps> Bye, guys. See ya, hissy. See you after work. Hey there. Hi, hi, butterfly. Yes, then I think we have our mission. We're going to help this butterfly find her family at the butterfly forest. <laughs> hey, look, she likes it. Come on, Vicky. Let's go find your family. Bye, Bye, Vicky. Bye, Bye Vicky. Huh. We're super duper <laughs> need to find our way to the butterfly forest, which is by the sunny warm beach. Don't worry, Vicky. You'll be back with this family before you know it. Butterfly bus lines all aboard. Sounds like they're going to the butterfly forest too. Then all aboard the butterfly bus. Look, Vicky, the wheels on this bus are going really round and round, and they're taking us right where we need to go. Sorry, Frank. There's a gas station and repair shop right there. I'm sure they'll fix this bus in no time. And she looks like she's missing her family, too. It's okay, Vicky. You don't need that big bus to take you to your family. Yeah, because you've got us. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful. What a view. But which way is the butterfly force? I think my arms are tired, but that's about it. <laughs> I see them flying near the ocean. Them who? That's why we're not going to walk. Hanging on sight. Cause the roads are winding. Moving down the mountain. It's a kite string. And hold it so I don't blow away. Got it? Got it. Can I hear you? Not really. Not here. Steer! Fear? There's nothing for the fear, Bingo. I've got you. for you to fly there. We'll find another way. Rolly! Positive. And Vicky saw our family there, didn't you? Then it's a good thing we practiced climbing Mount Bingoli this morning. Let's do this with puppy power. Is this your family, Vicky? Think that's a yes. Bye, Vicky. I'll miss you. Me too. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. This is Clint Manley, and I am back at the Butterfly Forest. I wonder if that butterfly that was here this morning... We made it, Frank! I'm glad they finally fixed that bus, huh? Nestor, one landed on me. Are you enjoying your trip to the Butterfly Forest, sir? It's a dream come true. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she is. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. I'm falling! Ugh. How was your flight? A little bumpy on the landing. How I wish I could be with you. So, I invented this to do the kinds of things I'd do if I was here. Hi, Bingo. Hi, Rolly.
I call him ARF, which stands for Auto Doggy Robotic Friend. ARF is here to do it all. I even programmed them to clean up any mess that you make before I get home from work. But with ARF here, no more mess. Hmm, he looks friendly. Wanna meet ARF? Maybe later. I'm trying to get this one spot on the back of my neck really clean, which means... Make a mess, yeah, make a mess, so Arf can have fun cleaning it up. Wait a minute, you want us to mess this place up? Someday. But first, I gotta learn how to read. Oh, nice job. I can hardly see the floor at all. <laughs> I'm okay. Wow, if Bob came home from work and saw a mess like this... Bob also programmed Arf to beg. I don't think we have another mess in us. Yeah. I either need a longer leg or a shorter neck. Leave me alone, dog body! Wait! No! Wait! Excuse, Arv. Oh, Arv is excused. Because Bob only programmed Arf to clean up after Bingo and Rolly, not to clean up after Hissy and Arf. So I guess the two of us are gonna have to clean this place ourselves. Puppy dog style. That sounds kind of fun. It's not gonna be fun, Rolly. It's going to be work. Clean up time, working together. Let's get that man to the floor. Just gotta wash these towels, and our job is done. What are we gonna do while they're washing? I'm gonna get you, Turkey! Hey, Rolly! Whoa! Whoa! Quick question. How much soap did you put in that washing machine? Look at me, Bingo! Ho, ho, ho! Keep getting higher, but there's nowhere else to go. Get together, we'll be okay. I'm home. <gasps> it's it's Bob. Bob. Like my clothes, right after they come out of the washing machine. <laughs> I guess my new invention really worked, huh? Uh -oh. Excuse our... You looking for someone to throw that stick? Oh, I wish I had time, but I'm heading out to buy stuff for the big game that's on TV. What else besides this stick do you think we could put in this machine? Bob said whatever we want. Wait a minute. What are you guys doing with Bob's special baseball? Bob's special what? No! Gonna play fish. We gotta get that ball back where it belongs. And I can't help chasing balls around. Watch it, I'm coming through. This is what puppies are supposed to do. Okay. 
Hey, Rolly. Rolly, no. Our mission is to get Bob's baseball before it... ...goes into that elevator. What do we do now? Then that bucket is on my list. Cupcake, we're on a mission. Yeah, we're fetching Bob's baseball. Well, I wouldn't want to get in your way, which is why I'll have Rufus get in your way for me. <laughs> okay, got some chips and my fruit smoothies for the game. Just need to make a quick stop at the yikes! Whoa! Played. This is bad. That drain could lead anywhere. If only we knew someone who knew where that drain drains out to. Rolly, we do! <laughs> okay, so, if we follow this drain through this pipe, up, back, and around, that baseball you're looking for should be coming out right about... Hello, baseball fans, and welcome to Teddy Peppercorn Day. And now, let's give a big welcome to our special guest, Teddy Peppercorn. Look at that. Wow, baseball. that's a really solid swing. Got his whole body behind it. Whoever finds that baseball with Teddy's signature on it is going to be one happy fan. Hey, to do who? We gotta get that ball. Get that ball. Hey there! Well, looks like you've been having fun with that fetch machine, huh? Hey, is that my special baseball? Well, I can see why you'd want to play with that. It's so rolly. <laughs> well, I guess I never turned this thing all the way around before to see that it was there. It is? Oh. What is it, Bob? <laughs> hey, where'd the doggy go? Oh, my computer. Oh, darn, it's broken. But at least I can look forward to seeing you two when I get home from work. Enjoy your nap, hissy. And the nap after your other naps. Wait, where'd it go? Where'd it go? There it is. Where'd it go? Watch it! Broly, did you hear what he said? Bob needs a pot of gold to fix his computer. And we can find one at the end of the rainbow. That's just a legend. What is? That at the end of every rainbow, there's a pot of gold. <laughs> Let's go find the pot of gold at the end of that thing. It looks like the rainbow ends behind that factory. But we know someone who does. Oh, sure. I know that factory. I collect stuff other people throw away. And when this friend of mine found plans for that place in the trash, see that ditch right there? You want to crawl through that to the front door. Then, when you're inside the factory, you're going to ride this conveyor belt through the assembly room. Stay out of trouble, and that pot of gold will be yours. Don't worry, Bullworth. Nothing is gonna trip us up. Ah! Hello? Either the water's getting deeper or my legs are getting shorter. Stay down. I'm gonna take a peek and see where that guard dog is. Is he gone? Yeah, and there's the front door, so come on. Then next room? Here we come. 
Bingo? Why are you going that way? I don't... Uh, I've got you! <sighs> Thanks for the paw. Anytime. Well, we said this next room was called the wrapping room. <sighs> These bubbles are wrapped around us so tight we can't walk. We've been bubble wrapped. And we're in trouble. We gotta pop these bubbles on the doggy double. We're, we're bubble wrapped. wrapped. And we're wrapped up tight. I'm twisting and turning. We did it, Rolly. We did it. Yeah, I just wish there was more bubble wrap for us to pop, because I could play with that stuff all day. <laughs> well, then, we're just gonna have to pop all of it. Yeah! Yahoo! They should put bubble wrap on every floor. But how are we gonna get down the hallway without going poppity pop, pop, pop? We'll have to walk between the bubbles. Okay, Rolly. Your turn. <laughs> and now that we're in the back, we should be able to see... <gasps> Whoa! The rainbow in the pot of gold. Well, you're back here. Dogs other than me aren't allowed back here. What do we do, Bingo? Mine too! You're a friend of Bola's? I am. I love how that guy collects stuff that's being thrown away. So when I found the plans for this factory in the trash, I gave them to him. Would it be okay if we took some of that gold home for Bob? Take whatever you want. It's all gonna be thrown out anyway. Hey, I should give some to Bullworth. We found the end of the rainbow and the pot of gold. Even though there wasn't a pot, but there was nothing but gold. Wait a minute. You mean there actually was something there? Must have fallen out of my computer this morning, but I didn't see it. Ha <laughs> ha! It works! But you know what? There aren't any dogs who are more special than you. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs>